Hey producers, let's talk about sidechain compression. It's a common and versatile effect with a ton of benefits. Originally devised in the 1930s for film audio, sidechaining was originally used to control harsh sibilance and dialogue. Today, sidechaining can be used in all kinds of ways. Most commonly, it's used to lower the volume of one instrument by listening to another. But why is it called sidechain? When I first started producing, things like synths, compressors, and EQ were big electronic boxes arranged in a sequence called a chain. Signal would travel from one unit to another down the chain. Some gear had a secondary input that didn't flow into the chain. Instead, it was used to control the effect. Since it didn't go out of the output, engineers referred to this as going into the side of the effect, hence side chain. Since the signal going into the side chain was driving the effect, it became known as the key input. Now let's set up a side chain in Ableton Live. It is so much simpler than it used to be. Check it out. I have these chords and this kick drum. I'd really like the chords to duck when the kick plays. So I'm going to just drag a regular old compressor onto my track, hit this little triangle icon to reveal the sidechain panel. I'll enable sidechain and then I'll select my key input. If you select a group or a drum rack, you'll have the option to choose each individual drum. Now I just adjust my threshold to get the effect going. Check it out. Make it more intense by adjusting the ratio. Check out these different views. This is my favorite view. If you like a pumping effect, turn up the release. If you want it quicker, turn the release way down. You can try pushing the attack a little higher to let more of the transients through. If you have a nice pumping effect, but you want it really dramatic, you can copy and paste the compressor multiple times. This was like completely impossible back in the old day, unless you had multiple physical compressor units. But look at how easy it is with Ableton. Pretty awesome, huh? And there you have it. Sidechaining is so easy and also so useful. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments and I'll do my best to reply. Thanks for watching Producer Quest.